to Covenant Presbyterian Church's Compassion Camp. This is session number three, and it's yoga and movement. Today's theme is about loving your neighbor in the Good Samaritan story and reaching out to neighbors. So I thought today, I'm very happy to have my next door neighbor help us with this yoga session. Yoga is a spiritual practice that began in ancient India and it centers the mind, helps relax you, and helps bring the spirit into the divine, into oneness. This meaningful practice has grown all over the globe with people of all faiths and beliefs. And they all get nourished from it in different ways. It's a powerful reminder of how we learn from each other. When we say namaste, we connect with siblings of all across the world. So we're going to start with the breathing exercise. And with yoga, with breathing, um, when you breathe in, you do it slowly. And then when you breathe out, you want it to go a little bit longer than when you breathe in. So if you breathe into a count of three, you can breathe out to a count of four. And we'll start to do that. And then we're going to add a mantra as we go, which is something you say during it. Just start by breathing into the count of three. One, two, three, out. One, two, three, four. In, two, three, out. Two, three, four. I bravely, two, three, reach out to love. Two, three, four. I bravely, two, three, reach out to love. Two, three, four. And now we'll do some poses. We'll start and rise up. We're going to start with mountain pose. Mountain pose, your feet are about hip width distance apart. You stand up straight. You suck in your stomach, and then you can take your shoulders up and sink them down your back. Your hands go to your sides. Look straight ahead, chin just slightly tilted down. Mountain pose. You feel strong, unshakable. And you take this strength of all your poses all your day. Now reach your hands up. to low plank and down into upward facing dog where your arms are straight again. We face the sun welcoming what this day holds for us and the ways will be called into action. From here flip your toes back over and raise your hips and push back into downward facing dog. Now jump your right leg forward and come up, your left heel goes down at a 45 degree angle, arms come up, pinkies in, warrior one. In warrior one, we focus power and stability, we feel strong and brave, and we cross barriers to reach out with love. Come back down into Downward Facing Dog. This time we put our left foot forward and we come up again into Warrior One. The right foot can go flat at a forward five degree angle. And once again, we use focus, power, and stability. We are strong and brave. We cross barriers to reach out and love. Come back down into downward facing dog. And then step or jump forward and come back up into mountain pose. 
feeling strong and unshakable. Okay, now you may sit. Lower your body to the mat. And put your feet straight up. Then reach up and fold forward. Crossing, stretching, and reaching can be uncomfortable. This is where we grow. And sit back up. And we put our feet flat on the mat. Raise our knees. Lie back down. Put our arms out to the tee. And then put our knees to the right side down to the ground. We cross our lines. Face back up and then turn your knees to the left side. And back up. Turn your knees and lift your hands and rock into a seated position. We cross lines to love. We're going to reach our hands up, breathe in. Pull them down, breathe out. And we say, no, let's stay. The light in me sees the light in you. And to me, that's the light of the Holy Spirit in everybody. That's our yoga portion.